All right, if you have a canvas belt and it's too big for you, usually you buy it and it's a big size and you need to resize it. What you do is you turn the buckle around and then get a screwdriver and pry in here. And that's got teeth. You can see those teeth grab onto the belt and you can move it up to make it the right size. So what I recommend is you try, you put it on around your waist and move this up and down until you've reached the right size and then you cut it. But you don't want to just cut it and leave it alone. What you want to do once you've found the right size is probably leave yourself a little bit of slack. If you're a kid that's growing, like I know a lot of people use these in the scouts. If you're a kid that's growing, then I would recommend leaving, you know, a few inches of slack behind the buckle that nobody's going to see anyway. And then as you get bigger, you just pop it open and slide it loose. And then you size the front of it so that it, when you latch it, you know, it latches like that so that people only see the shiny side of the buckle. But on the back side, you leave a little bit of room. And then after you cut it, you want to burn it with fire because otherwise it'll unravel. These are made out of synthetics, so it's pretty easy to uh, just, just take a little bit of fire and burn the end of it to make sure that it doesn't unravel. Go. I've, I've marked out the spot where I want to cut it, so I just get some heavy-duty scissors. Cut right through it. I'm gonna just burn the end of it with some fire. If you don't have matches or lighter, you can use your stove. And you can see it's it's melted it to become shiny, so all the the, the plastic isn't gonna unravel the, the strands because they've been bonded together by the fire. All these belts are made out of uh, synthetic plastic type material that you can burn with fire and some of them are made out of you know, more of a cotton kind of material that if you burn it it'll just burn so you probably want to take the piece that you cut off and test it by burning it and if it melts down to a nice shiny edge then you're good and if it just catches on fire then rather than burning the end to seal it you want to use some super glue just just run a bead of super glue down it and that will stop it from unraveling